So I've just give the jump leads a bit of a jiggle. I don't think one of them was contacting properly. Uh, I've seen a few sparks, so we'll have another go at it. Okay. Not that the gear, but the clutch is working. Clutch pedal, by the way, there at the bottom. Sounds very good to me. Impressive, really. I'm surprised myself. I'll give it a little bit of a rest. Uh, I don't really want to do it much more than that because it hasn't run, like I say. Uh, dashboard, again, still a few lights on it. I don't know if that's. You can turn the airbags off, so I don't know if that's what they are. Remember, I know we did turn the airbag off for the child seat over there, but I don't know. So I've just turned it on. Anything else? Uh, I don't know. I don't think everything looks to be okay. Before I turn it off, the revs have dropped down now to a thousand from just over to about twelve hundred. All looks to be running okay. Uh, stuff like that, still operating okay. Don't know what else I can test. First indications that it looks okay to me. Have a look through the
menu, I don't think there's any more info I can look at on there. To show you, no. Service. Service, distance to service, 2951 miles it says. So it's uh, still in. Menu off. Speed, right, turn the menu off, back to that screen. Okay, what I'll do is I'll put the camera near the back exhaust pipe so you can see what's coming out, and I'll give it oh, a little bit, of, little bit of white smoke is coming out now. I don't know if that's just the uh, water that's come out from uh, the engine. You see that? That's the sun shining through it for you. So there's a bit of smoke there. Uh, let's, let's see it coming through the sun. Revs are starting to come down a little bit. Again, we've got down to what? 900. And just still looking fine. I don't really want to rev it too hard to get rid of it, but... The engine sounded like it hunted a little bit then. I think it does sound quieter though. I don't have to shout to be heard, eventually. Drop the bonnet and have a sound. Hydraulic bonnet, obviously. Back in. That's me on the pedal, by the way. Moving it a little bit, switching it. Uh, I'm not taking it over 2000 revs, uh, I don't want to do any damage. So it drops it's steady at 8 900 revs there now. Engine seems to have smoothed. Nothing into hard, still is a little bit of smoke coming out. Sun, wrong way. That's how much smoke's coming out. Last rev to show you the smoke, and then I'm going to call it a day.
Right, that was up to two, two and a half thousand revs. Uh, I'm going to take the key out and show it you. The uh, <coughs> alarm does generally work now. There's a bit of power in there. Show you that. Doesn't seem to be now like. Let's take it off. There isn't a lot of power in the car, obviously. I'm going to start it up for a couple of minutes. In fact, the red light, oh yeah, the red light is on this. No, the alarm isn't coming on, but it does work, the alarm. Last time I charged it up by jumping it before Christmas, it did uh, start working. There is a slight dint in the bonnet there. You probably can't see it. Uh, any other bodywork blemishes? Not really noticeable. There was somewhere where it was dinked by... A door, not exact. See where that is at the minute. It's slightly damp the car though, so it's difficult to see. Uh, no, sorry, I can't remember where it is. Any more questions? Anyway, give us a shout. Cheers.